Bryant snapping a streak of eight straight playoff appearances. And I think one of the problems of the Nets the other night against the Knicks, and we talked about it uh, during the course of the telecast, here is Salmons, gets it down low. Mikey Moore. Did whatever was asking him to do. Last year against the Nets, had a career year, and certainly earned the contract that he got from Sacramento, and he hasn't disappointed when you talk to those coaches. Our chest fires up a three. Kevin Martin out with a strained right groin, and the feeling is he'll be out another three to five weeks. Salmons for three. Underneath, great hands, both guys and Boones and Williams, they do an excellent job of finishing underneath. Pretty pass from Odrick. Salmons on the play and getting the tip in. Lawrence Frank, not a fan, yelling, host up. Marcus Williams to enter the ball game with, pretty much has it all. Big guys that can finish. Malik Allen is a shooter, so perfect with pick and roll situations. A finisher in Jefferson, and then right, a shooter. He did beat Garcia off the dribble. This is Dante Jones, recent addition to the Sacramento Kings. Tried that blind pass, Mikey Moore did not expect. University of Washington, only 19 years old, first round draft pick of Sacramento, the 10th pick overall. Pause with Moore and Salmons up front. And here's Salmons. Each other's game too well. We played two on two. We had some other guys that were role players. <laughs> we, we both were playmakers on the offensive. Nice fake. And here's Salmons releasing and puts it down. Six points. Garcia sits down with 13. Salmons posting on Kid. John Salmons with foul line at all the other night against the Knicks. And shot just seven to 21. It was an off night. 14 points for Jefferson, who has been among the leading scorers in the NBA. Shot clock down to five. Salmons. And Jefferson got it down low. Moore with the block. And then Boone was stopped by Miller. Nice move by Salmons. Protecting the ball. And he same people should should not have been mad at Stephon Marbury when he was saying he was so great on a bad team. Right now, Jason Kidd is the point guard of a bad basketball team. Wait a second. There's some logic I'm not following. What? I'm saying this what? is a 10-14 team. Yeah. I can't put him. You are claiming that this is a bogus question that our producer... Or I should say, coordinating producer slash producer Franklin Briggs planted. But if you do have a question for our announcing staff, chased by Udrick, Williams, rebounded by Miller. Nice fake by Salmons. And just did get it. And you're Josh Boone, you catch that basketball, you have to tell somebody else, meet me at the rim. You have to go to finish and finish with a car. Boone knocked it away, but it was recovered. Shot. That's up by three. Good play by Boone to knock it away. And Allen came up with it. Armstrong's pass picked off, and here's a common fall. 1-800-3, go, Nets. The Nets now lead 84-81. Well, we talked about the first half. Lawrence Frank decided to go with Darrell Armstrong as opposed to Marcus Williams. And Darrell Armstrong picking up full court behind the work. The point guard. Carter on the run, got bottled up, lost it. Good play by Jones. Salmons. He has been un. Jones can't find anybody and just did avoid a five-second violation. This is Quincy Newby, the second-year man from Rutgers. 
Salmon's working on right. Five on the 24. Garcia. It counts on the foul by Williams. Salmon's took it away. Salmon's took it away from Jefferson. And here's Salmon taking all the way.